it's three fouls in the first half that you know they lose the point guard and you know, press you know was effective and uh, so, so that you know they got us out to a big lead at halftime. I think that was a big um, made up a big difference in the game. Um, you know they they've got a really good team. The one area is depth at the point guard spot. When he got that wasn't a plan. It just happened. But when he got three fouls. And, and these guys play, these are our leaders, and I just thought they did a great job of keeping our concentration through the game, which is not easy to do when you're 18 and 22 years old. I was, I was really proud of that. Trey, how much of the press did you help him fall out of the time his hands? Well, that, that was part of, you know, when, when they get into their half court set, you know, as we all saw in the Temple game, they're really good at that. They're very good. And we didn't want them to be able to get into that half court set because then you got to deal with him, and, and it's hard. Well, we were ready to trap him, we were ready to do everything. But we thought if the press was affected, then we wouldn't have to do it as much. And like I said, once Harrison got in foul trouble, then we were just going to stay with it. scoring at all and that's when that's when you score. If you're a good player and you just worry about playing the right way, you score. And he's a good player and he plays the right way. It just happens. James, can you comment on your start to the season? Is it you know, your approach? Is it something you're doing differently out there? I understand the situation and what we're doing like that. It's a lot better. Um, like Coach said, I've been here for four years and everything is just on a higher level now. I'm understanding that the game is getting better and him and our team, my teammates have put me in great positions to make plays. Ryan, when it, when that zone trap is working the way it is, it almost looked like you guys couldn't wait to get back on the defense. Do you sort of feed off of that? A little bit, but uh, just as a team, we're just trying to play hard. And in, in the press, we just we kind of we, we had him going. Darren played really well at the top of the zone in the press, but uh, we were faking it, denying. And we got them to pick up the dribble a couple times. How important was it for the team to get off to the quick start that they did? Um, they're a good team, and we just wanted to come out and play harder. Um, we got off to a good start, but we got off to a good start doing what we do. Uh, started on defense and rebounding, and then our defense and rebounding led to easy buckets, and that's what we needed to do. And that's how we started the game. Size, you know. I mean, the last two games, it's so hard for big guys when you're playing those those mid-major teams. And these guys have big bodies. You know, it's more like a, a Big East team, and it's hard for those guys because they're chasing guys around on the perimeter. When you're playing against guys like this, you're around the basket. You know, so I, I, I'm trying to explain that to him. You know, one game you played nine minutes. You know, you get caught out on the perimeter, you get a foul. You get set screen, you get a foul. He was in foul. So. This was more his kind of game. I was really happy for him. It was almost worse for Towson playing against a bigger team and better for him. Did you see Matt that you going against somebody a little more his size? Yeah, yeah. I think he really took the challenge. He he, he guarded Benjamin. I mean, you know, in their defense, we're all home. We're watching the Temple game. I mean, they look great. We're sitting at home. We're all watching it. We're talking to each other, you know. So you're pretty fired up to play against them. Really good, you know. So um, I think that helped us, and, and I think it helped. I think Daniel took on the challenge, you know, of guarding Benjamin. I think he likes that. He really likes to defend. Anything else? Thank you.
Thank you. Thanks, guys.